I practice the martial art of Aikido, which is about creating harmony in people's lives. And it's about moving energy, not it to, to hurt somebody, but to bring out good benefit for each person, as well as the environment that you're involved with. And from my practice, I have an idea. I've learned about respect from a different idea of where many people have a sense of, I'm the tough guy, I'm the boss, I'm the parent, I'm the man, and you should respect me. Or, OK. And then wait till I get to be grown up. You know, like a child thinks, wait till I'm dad, you know? Or mother or something. That's a war mentality. That's different than the practice of creating harmony. And I'm going to do an exercise here. I'm going to ask for a volunteer, a brave, brave soul, to come up. Oh, OK. What's your name? Uh, Tom. Tom. And Tom's going to stand here. And he's going to play out a sense of what most people feel when they're dealing with somebody who they have to respect, or they're afraid of, or they want to beat the heck out of. OK? And it's that kind of war mentality. Tom is graciously, I hope, <laughs> you're willing to put this mask on. <laughs> I think we know who he is now. <laughs> OK? So I want you to think about the Frankensteins in your life when they come your way and how you mostly deal with them. And mostly, I believe, most of us approach it as if there's a war at stake here. I gotta hold my ground or I gotta run to the hills. So, Tom, what I'd like you to do is come at me, like Frankenstein, <laughs> okay? And my first way may be to, ah! That's the damsel in distress attitude. Oh, help me, help me, somebody bigger than me. Oh. Okay, that's one way. Do you know that in yourself? You ever feel that way? You've got a boss that's being somewhat disrespectful, and you got to take it, right? OK, here's the second way. I can take him. I'm tough. I'm the John Wayne guy. Here, here, oh, 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 oh. I'll fight him. OK, who wins this fight? Nobody. Nobody. You ever beat Frankenstein? No. The, the cards are stacked against you. So, but we still do that, right? And we still have these two options. It's this one, to attack or to run. How many of you ever saw a taxi driver? You know? Who, you talking to me? You talking to me? Hey, you talking to me? And it's a little, this, he's playing Frankenstein with himself. OK? We often do that. We lose a sense of perspective, what we most care about. And instead of taking on Frankenstein's anger, as if it's my responsibility, I cause it, he feels anger. He feels anger. He could do other things. So this is a third choice. Here comes, he comes again, going to choke me. Instead, I just. Get off the line, as they say. <laughs> How you doing? I say. But he comes back, you know. He's got his ideas, things. And I turn, and here it is. I'm in my life. I feel centered, spacious. Here it comes again, <laughs> like this. It can go on all day. We can have a nice conversation. How are you? Thank you. <laughs> I think he's identified with his role. <laughs> okay.